Operational service exposes us to the light and shadows of mankind. The majority who serve come back to a hero's welcome. However, for a few they return to the shadows of physical injury, combat trauma, or in some cases, post-traumatic stress disorder, PTSD. Given their experience, this could be understandable or even expected, but it is a living nightmare. Many give their lives, whilst others endure life-changing injuries. And some suffer hidden wounds, an enemy within, damage that can't be seen, and which is often disguised, dismissed, or denied by those who suffer or need help. Rank, role, or service is no barrier to PTSD. Shell shock is a glimpse into that world of confusion, doubt, and disconnection. Tommy's story is not about war. It's about what happens when people come home, when the war is over, the politics passed, the media moved on and their purpose lost. In the armed forces, PTSD is something of a taboo. Everyone is aware of operational stress, but admitting it is a whole different ball game, especially in culture defined by grit. PTSD is a normal reaction to an abnormal situation. It can affect people and those around them in different ways. It's nothing to be ashamed of, but tell that to a squatty. Some take years to understand they have an issue, let alone pick up the phone to get help. Whilst Tommy's story may seem like fiction, for some service personnel it is a stark reality. Unresolved mental health problems lie at the heart of some of our greatest social challenges. Too often, people feel afraid to admit that they are struggling. This fear of prejudice and judgment stops people from getting help, can destroy families and even end lives. A lifeline from the black hole of PTSD is our collective awareness and willingness to help. If we resolve to be patient, to listen, to understand and help, we can change the perception of mental health so that stigma no longer prevents people getting the help that they need. My role in this has been simple. I listened. I listened. I listened. I listened. I listened. I listened. One word of warning, Tommy likes to talk a lot. Tommy likes to swear a lot. If he goes on too long, just throw something at him. He's used to that.